Hello everyone, this is Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and these are your November 2016 Angel Oracle Card Readings. For this month I'm going to be using the Archangel Oracle Cards deck by Doreen Virtue and of course pulling a color card from the Sacred Language of Color Oracle deck by Anna Seagal. If you'd like to get a personal reading with me, just go to my website at angelsouls444.com. You have to go to the services page. And if you'd like to support me on Patreon, I'll leave that information down below. And of course, please don't forget about all the courses and extra readings that I will have up on Gumroad. It's just gumroad.com slash angelsouls. Let's get to it. Hi there, Sagittarius. Let's see what's going on for you for November 2016. Oh, there we go. Nurture yourself. Okay. Be good to you. Calm the emotions. Yeah, it feels like a lot of people, you know, we're getting towards the end of 2016. It's like, okay, who hasn't been through something major this year? You know what I mean? The world has gone through major things this year. So time to just tap back into that innocence, which is the, the quickest way to your spirituality is through your innocence. And because you're, you're, you have faith there, <laughs> that's where the faith lives. It's, it's within you. So, um, so take care of yourself like you would a baby. Yes, and that might, for some of you, mean that you have to rejuvenate a little bit. And that's what this card is going to talk about here. Comfort. Yeah. Some of you are having some things um, go out of your world in November that you were trying to hang on to with, like, both hands and wrapping your leg around. Being like, no, you can't go, you know. But <laughs> as we'll see here, it has to go. All right, so let's start with this first card. Nurture. Archangel Gabriel, as you nurture a child, you nurture your own inner child. Both activities are important for you right now. So you got to go back within, all right? And finding the joy, not worrying so much about everything, okay? Um, I just heard the need for vengeance. <laughs> Release your need for vengeance. Um, God sees everything. God's source creator sees everything. So if something was unjust, unfair, you know, it shouldn't have turned out the way that it did, you know, everything will work itself out. Just you take care of you. Now, this is indicating that you're tired, something um, that maybe you have struggled for and fought for and you really thought it was going to come to fruition um, and it just didn't. For some of you, it might be looking at a business that you were trying to get going. You're like, I'm losing money on this. You know, it's not good. Or you're in a relationship or whatever. You're in a health situation where you're like, this doctor's not working. You know, this doctor's not giving me the answers that I need or whatever's going on it might be time for a big change but for you guys this month it feels like that change doesn't go away readily or excuse me the thing that you wanted doesn't go away readily and you don't accept the change very well because we have comfort it's Archangel Osriel and he says I am with you in your time of need helping your heart to heal so there might be a moment this month where you feel like a failure oh I messed it up Oh, I'm going to be alone forever. No, you ain't. <laughs> and you heard me correctly. I said ain't. Okay. And I'm a writer. I know how to speak. So, um, or I know words. Doesn't necessarily mean that I know how to speak. But anyway, Osriel's here to help you uh, transform and to come away from what you thought should be. But there's something amazing that happens when you let go. The second you let go, Da, 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 da. You have a brilliant idea. It's Archangel Uriel. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action to bring your idea uh, to fruition. Now, this is sort of like all of a sudden you get out of your own way and you turn around and you're like, oh, now there's room for more creativity. Now there's room for something new. Or once, let's say you thought you were losing your business and maybe you do go ahead and close down a business or something like that. And then you get this brilliant idea of like, oh my gosh, that's what my business needed to include or whatever. It's just you getting out of your thought box and seeing uh, the bigger picture and therefore getting the clarity about what you need to change in your world and you're opening the path for that to happen. Gifts from God is the final card before we go on to the color card. And this is Archangel Sandalfin. Did we have another one? No. Okay, Archangel Sandalfin. We angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. So let the old junk go, <laughs> okay? If, if it's just not working, it's okay to let it go. You can do so lovingly. Let yourself be cleared and healed and then watch for the signs. Watch how things are kind of guiding you and trying to get you to go into a new direction. There are so many wonderful things to come for you this month, okay? 
Your color card, of course, is pearl. <laughs> I love this. Pearl, connect to the divine. The number is 25, which reduces to seven. That's a heavenly number. So it's saying everything's okay. Everything's okay. We're watching you struggle for no reason. When you connect to the divine, you are connecting to higher knowledge. And again, it's that whole big picture kind of thing. Just because this one little thing didn't work out doesn't mean you don't have beautiful, amazing things waiting to flow right to you. Okay? It's like... Okay, here I go with an, uh, an example. It's like sitting in a room and you're starving. All you're doing is looking at the entry, the, the empty pantry or whatever. And you're like, there's no food, there's no food, but there's a refrigerator right behind you. <laughs> if you just get your focus off of what's not there and you turn around, you're gonna see exactly what's on offer for you. I know, I don't always have the best examples, but there it is anyway. So have a beautiful month and I am sending you guys so much love. Take care.